of B-Force are pretty much identical. They're within 1% of the weight. Since you need to knock out 51% of a multibot to win, you need to knock out both halves Five, of B-Force to get the knockout here. B-Force has a weight bonus running one, as a multibot. They can weigh up to 42 pounds, fight. whereas Phenomenon only 30. Away we go. That is great mobility from Phenomenon. Oh! Putting B-Force in a bad place immediately. Going after the the wedges on the front of that half of B-Force really overpowering Phenomenon. Oh, nice little trick there by the upside down half of B-Force to get itself out of the thing. However, unfortunately, it's now gotten itself back into the thing on the wall. The treads give it a good amount of mobility, might be able to get back on its feet. Yeah, I could see it happening, but it's gonna take a few moments. Oh, Phenomenon around the side, digging away at the tread. B-Force able to escape. <laughs> Second half of B-Force, get itself off the wall. I love <laughs> this approach of uh, coming upside down and backwards upon your opponent and using your attack <laughs> to self right yourself. They're unable to self right off the wall, just digging into the wood. Phenomenon, however, with a cross arena uh, slam. Oh, that was uh, just a, a feint from Phenomenon as, as half of B-Force scooted on by. <laughs> now, Phenomenon's fork is stuck Whoa. in the air. That could be a big issue here as they flip the other yellow half of B-Force back. Yeah, that is a game changer if B-Force can take advantage of it, but now it the, is a... The black half of B-Force is stuck next to the house robot. I wonder, is it just propped there or is it dead? I haven't seen a request for an unstick. I think they're going to save that unstick uh, in case their other robot becomes stuck somewhere. Uh, hard oh. to say for sure. I don't know if this is oh, an no, official... That, yeah, that there, does look like an, an official unstick. unstick. And there uh, they go, with only a minute and 17 left. I guess they figure... Uh, the weapon on the yellow half of B-Force has been down for some yes. time. Unable to take advantage of the fork issues that Phenomenon's having, keeping Phenomenon away from getting these hits. The black half flipped back over. Now the black half is uh, driving a little slower. B-Force is having a bunch of issues here, taking these hits from the larger Oh, this is great Phenomenon. control. Look at this pin from B-Force wow. on Phenomenon. When you can do that and show off that, hey, I'm still a lethal force and even without a weapon. And able to release the pin. The black one's weapon not really spinning as fast as we're used to. Phenomenon getting another hit there. Oh! Yeah, the black half is definitely struggling. Phenomenon's showing off at the end of the fight here. I think Phenomenon had a good beginning. Oh, oh what a place to get stuck. And they might get the KO with 20 seconds left and both halves of B-Force stuck upside down. What a show of driving prowess from Brandon Bennett Young in Phenomenon today. Uh, a stupendous place to leave your opponent if you want to make an impression in the judges, but it doesn't matter. Ladies and gentlemen, you have a KO. Your winner in this fight, who will be going on to fight Anxiety, is phenomenon with